Hi there. Today we're going to review a app on Shopify called Judge Me. That's J U D G E dot me. You can find it in the App Store. It's an app that will help you re help your customers uh, leave reviews on your website. <clears throat> this uh, app is fully compatible with Google, and when the reviews are made, they automatically go to Google as seen here in search results. So these stars here are part of the app, it gives you the ratings. This counts for SEO, Google sees this. This makes this app so worthwhile because you don't have to do anything to make this part happen. The app will automatically um, uh, send the information uh, onto your web page, and Google will index it and you will get SEO juice for it as well. So let's start here. We're going to start at the home page. And as usual, you go down to the apps. And if you don't already have the app, uh, once this page loads up, you can go to the bottom down here to the app store, which is a little bit hidden here. Um, <clears throat> view Shopify app store, open that and find the app. The app is again called judge me and it's a review app. There's a bunch of them. Um, I'm using the paid one at $15 a month. It's a set it and forget it app. All you have to do if you want to is curate your reviews. That means you review them and write back something to them or disallow the reviews because a person is, you know, just out of control, raging at you or something like that. So once you load the app, um, <clears throat> you'll get this ju the judge me dashboard. Now, typically there'd be some, some apps, uh, some reviews that you want to review here and you go ahead and do that. I'll show you um, what the reviews look like. So there's the review that we got just today, uh, 18 hours ago. It was a five star review from a customer of ours and he just gave us a five star. Now, some people can write something too. Um, go big or go home. Is this what she wrote? And we always like to do a reply. A reply shows that you're engaged with your customer and you can do that in the curating section. So once they send you a review, you get an email that uh, triggers you to look at the uh, review and either accept it or not accept it or to write something or not to write something. Um, and you can do that all there right from the email. It'll take you right to the app. Um, so there's several different choices here. You can take a look at your reviews that you didn't reply to, the ones that you did reply to, published, unpublished reviews. Um, so that's the day-to-day -day workings on it. The setup is pretty simple. And if you are not comfortable setting up this stuff, uh, the customer service that JP gives on this app is phenomenal. I cannot say enough, he's been great. Um, and he's making some more improvements on the app, which we shall see how those come out shortly. Okay, so in the app section here, in the settings sections, you need to just take a look at this part here. This is the most important part. Um, how many items you want to review, if the order has multiple items, I do three. And then how many days after they get the item, um, how many days after they order the item that the automatic email should be sent to the customer to do a review. I do seven days. It gives my customers a chance to get it in the mail. Um, my mail takes about three days, two to three days. It gives them a few days to try the, the uh, tea out. I'm a tea seller um, or the tea wear, like a teapot or something. And um, I don't want to bombard them right away with that. And so seven days is what I chose. And then, um, and then we do another request three days later. Since I do three, I ask them to review three items. Three days later, they get another email and another email. So <clears throat> they'll get three emails from me because of this starting on day seven. Um, also, I like to put my name here that it's coming from Good Life Tea and the email address. Um, there's also a blacklist section here if you don't want. Um, for example, I don't want Winello to send me something. So. Um, I put Winello in as a part of my blacklist. There's no sense in sending um, reviews to Winello. Uh, Winello is a shopping platform similar to Amazon. It's also an app. 
Now you've got the email templates. I'd pay a little bit of attention to this. You can either go with this one or this one. Um, if you don't choose, you'll get the default. The default email is very easy to set up. You don't have to do anything if you don't want to to this. Um, and this is what the default email looks like when you receive it. So you have a choice here. Um, <clears throat> it'll pull up the customer's name if it's available. So it says, hi, John. And then this is the seven days that I talked about earlier in the settings. Uh, we filled your order of these two teas from our store, Good Life Tea. This is also another field that we put in earlier. We'd love to get your feedback on a product. And they just push one of these buttons here. They can uh, add a title to it, loved it, hated it, whatever it is. And they can write something here and then they hit this button. It's as simple as that for your customer. They don't have to go back to your website or anything. They just do it right from the email page. And it takes, what, like 10 seconds here um, to do this. And once this is done, it'll show up on your product page, of course. Um, and on your product page, let's just see here. <clears throat> Sorry, bear with me. Let me pull up a product. I'll show you the cinnamon. So this is the product, and you'll see that there's stars right here, right on your product page. Um, by the way, the color of the stars is something that you can edit. I got 16 reviews on this product. That leads, uh, that gives your customers a lot of, um, how would you say, a lot of confidence that this is a good product to buy. And the reviews are down at the bottom here. So. They're all marked with verified, meaning that the customer actually bought this product from us as opposed to just some random person coming on the website and giving me a review. And I, I chose to show four of them. Now, Google picks this up, like I said, and it will show you um, the reviews on its website as well, right here. Hot Cinnamon Spice, Our Best Lucy Tea, Good Life Tea. There it is, four 0.7 stars, 16 reviews, and that's exactly the same thing here. So it's pretty simple. It's great. You just set it up, and if you have trouble setting it up, talk to PJ, uh, JP rather, and um, he'll fix this stuff up for you, make it run smoothly. It costs $15 a month, but the, the Google SEO juice is, is, is wonderful, and the customer, uh, new customers coming to your website We'll see the reviews and we'll buy with confidence. So there you go. That's the app in a nutshell. Um, I love this app. I strongly recommend it. Thanks a lot. Oh, and if you have any questions or comments, please uh, write them down in the comment section below. Thank you.